the CBS Broadcast Center in Los Angeles. This is CBS 2 News at 5 p.m. So as Mayor Garcetti just mentioned, this is National Nurses Week, the perfect time to say thank you to frontline medical workers. This pandemic has them going above and beyond the call of duty. CBS 2's Amy Johnson shows us how people are showing their appreciation. Thank you. I think we all feel very emotional, surprised. A special parade to celebrate the nurses working at the Altamed Evaluation Center in Boyle Heights. Thank you. Woo! They swab for coronavirus, but there was a brief break today for National Nurses Day. That is so cute. When we saw the cops and the helicopters and, you know, our fellow staff members, it was like, I literally got teary-eyed. So sometimes we feel like we're a little bit overlooked, but we're not. And they continue to let us know that they're thinking about us, they support us. Simone Graves has been a nurse for four years. Like, I'm not a hero. I'm just doing what I always do. She doesn't worry about herself, only her children, making sure to shower and change her clothes before seeing them at home. My mom is a nurse. Growing up, seeing her in the hospital and seeing what she's doing, and then mainly just wanting to care for people. Um, that's the type of person I am. Always wanting to care and always wanting to give to others. Graves is one of six nurses that works here each day at the Ultimate Evaluation Center. They can see up to 200 cars each day, and oftentimes those cars are filled with family members. A similar scene at Riverside Community Hospital. I'm without words. Um, I've been in the hospital a long time. We always look forward to Nurses Week, Nurses Day, but today, I have to tell you, is so emotional. The men and women working on the front lines honored by the Patriots Veterans Group. They came out to show us their, their support, their love, and their respect for what we do. And it's mutual. You know, we're all here under uh, serious uh, conditions here. And, you know, we're all just doing our best to make sure that everyone's safe. And I believe that these people are really showing their great appreciation. God bless you. Thank you. Amy Johnson, CBS 2 News.